Salutations, my fellow dandies. I'm Jack Dandy. And we're not playing Zelda today. We're playing Final Fantasy 16 because the demo came out, uh, which I wasn't aware was coming out. Um, I am not looking forward to this game coming out. I've tried really hard to be excited for this game. I've watched every demo. I've I've looked at gameplay. I just I just am not excited for this game. So, but I thought I want to give it a fair shot because I really want to be excited. It's a new Final Fantasy game, and I like Final Fantasy. I think so. I, I the, the demos come out. We're gonna play the demo. See if I can't get excited for the game by playing the demo. And if I can't get excited at the end of this, then I guess this game just isn't for me. Uh, and progress carries over, so it's not a wasted effort either. So that's 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 my favorite kind of demo. Or all the ones where they go uh, play 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 this. A technical demo and we'll give you a free hat in the game. It's like, ah, oh, yeah, free hat. Uh, yeah. And then um, at 11, I, I did load it up, but I was worried this would have a cold opening, so I didn't go any further than this. Uh, at 11, we'll watch the Capcom thing, so that's about two hours from now. Um, it's only like 36 minutes, apparently. So we'll watch that. Uh, if we don't quite finish this, we'll come back to it and finish it off. Um, I think there's two sections to this demo. There's like a prologue section where you play as a kid, and then there's a bit where it skips forward. I think the prologue's the only bit that carries over. The other bit's just kind of like a gameplay demo so you can see what the actual gameplay's like. I don't know how long the prologue is though. Um, yeah, let's go! It was most oh, I'm gonna be wearing subtitles. Said that the land of Alistia is blessed in the light of the mother crystals. Let me, let me get that tiny. It was this light which finally led our forebears out of the darkness. Tiny dandy. Yet, what they saw in the light gave rise to temptation. Temptation that ever lures us back into the crystal shadow. And thus did our journey begin. So I think these are like it's 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 a bit like animorphs. Except the animorphs are like deities. Next to the cheese stone. Tasty looking lava. Oh, hang on, I'm, I am in control. Oh, I'm the bird! Look at this. Oh, I hit, I can evade. I, I don't know to what end. I didn't evade. Well, you've redeemed reverse, reverse, okay. Now I'll have to attack triangle with the book controller upside down. Oh no! I mean, it's. The R1 is that side now. I don't. I, there didn't seem to be any penalty for not dodging, I'll be honest. Unless I just. Unless I just get a game over now. Oh, how anticlimactic would that be? This is a terrible matchup. These are both fire types. That's me. I think his name's Clive. I'm not gonna remember any of those things. Oh, everyone's got a scar on their face. I thought I was special. I guess maybe it's a tattoo. I, looking at it clo more closely, it's a tattoo. Okay. Oh, thank God, I did wonder. It'll be light soon. 
Those camps have begun to stir. You all know the target. Shiva's dominant. And only the dominant. No one else. Where's the fun in that? How do we even know the girl will be among them? Our kind do not question orders. We follow them. Try to keep that in mind. Oh. So are we all Let's animals? Get this done. fed up. I quite like my demeanour so far, just like <sighs> okay. It's a nice bit of escapism to play as a character who feels like I do a lot of the time during my day. Focus, Wyvern. You are key to this mission's success. Yes, Sergeant. Okay. I still unfortunately have two minutes of upside down I controller. Focus, I I'm focusing. Alright. Let's spin. I am called Clive. Uh Okay. Got it. We don't have time for this. All hell is about to break loose. Hey, you know every video game where you press start to access the menu? You access the menu by pressing start in this one as well. So that's good to know. Thanks, tutorial. We're just in time. Oh. I miss when people fought wars like this. Just, you know, find a canyon and run at each other. It's a shame that wars like this ended one before, you know, TV started. Like, this would be great to televise. If you ignore all of the, you know, like, death. You know, put all the ethical issues aside. This would be great Saturday morning TV. Is that, is that what we're trying to get to? What do you mean, you refuse? Did you not pledge your swords to our cause? Come now. Marshal, the King of Walud is our guest. God, everyone looks so fed up. And you have His Majesty's answer. <sighs> 
So is this, like, I, I guess it's more like Avatar, where there's like a flame tribe and a water I tribe. That you summoned us at all. Have you so little faith in your own men? It was the Dalmex who drove back the Crusaders in the Battle of the Twin Realms, was it not? Or am I mistaken? Besides... Your dominant has yet to take the field. And when he does... Our knights would only get in the way. Perhaps you have not heard, but the Iron Blood now have their own dominant. We would be fools to underestimate them. Bugger their knights. What did you say? Not literally. Should this citadel be allowed to fall? The capital will lie exposed. And I doubt the Crusaders will wait for the good king's pawns to line up before taking to the board. Which He's gonna be a boss later. Just leaves me. Oh the iron blood will rule the day they set foot on storm. Oh, is he Shiva's dominant? This game is over. You cock. <laughs> <laughs> take care. That's all going to be a game the of thrones. Take care when he chases the hair. Or do you think me one of the latter? No, my love. You are a lion. You're my lion. <laughs> I'm not afraid of a little frost, Benedicta. But I will need someone to warm me when I come home. Oh, maybe he's not. I guess maybe he's not. Okay, I don't know who he is then. The front lines are gone. This is our chance. The chaos will conceal us. Control again. So I can jump now. And that's it, that's it. Van. Wait. Something's not right. Titan. So the Dalmax finally grew tired of being slaughtered. Is that the big guy from earlier then? Okay, I think that might be the big guy from the previous cutscene. I mean, 
it's very pretty, there's no denying, isn't it? Even if I knew Titan was on our side, technically, I wouldn't know if I'd have the confidence to keep fighting under his feet. You don't get to die here, Wyvern. Move! Do I have a dash? I'm going down here. We are we getting paid for this? Or oh, it's not? I, I, or are we like slaves and contracted? It's not clear. I don't know whether the the tattoos are like it's a sign that we're a mercenary group or a sign that we're slaves or both. Am I called Wyvern because it rhymes with... It's my full name Clyvern, and it rhymes... And that's why my nickname's Wyvern. Am I Clyvern the Wyvern? Who's gonna stand there? Children can be so mean. Actually, no, Wyvern's a pretty cool nickname, as far as they go. I think he had a dash. Wyvern! Wyvern! I told you before, you do not get to die here. Oh, what about the other guy? He got to die, I think. He's not coming with us. Brother. Okay, I'm pretty sure he died. Or maybe he'll come back at like hour 40. If you're not cut out to be a shield, there's always work for you in the stables. Unless, of course, you think you can defend your master while sat on your ass in a puddle of pig swill. I'm sure he'd find a way. My brother always looks after me. <laughs> right? Ah. Uh, you're sure to hit him eventually. Don't give up now. You weren't the one who just got crushed by a rock a second ago, were you? That was a different guy. Early stages, baby. Final Fantasy on a Monday. What is this shit? It's a different Final Fantasy to normal. It's the new one. They dropped a demo yesterday. Or well, today. I can't remember. If, I think it came out today. It's the brand new one. So I don't know what's going on. Let's start again from the beginning. I'm currently having a... Well, this is. I'm literally right at the start of a flashback. I got, I got hit with a rock. And passed out. Alright, so... Uh, squared and melee attack. Okay, that's... 
pretty standard. I attack so hard I cause a sort of sonic boom. That's how strong I am. Such swordsmanship will serve you well in the field. But can the same be said of your spellcraft? The flames of the phoenix burn within you. I, I'm not. I'm, I'm still figuring out the plot on this one, but I think it's. I think it's. Come it's right. part avatar, down. part animorphs. So we're we're like the flame clan or fire clan. I think they were called in Avatar, but some of us can turn into big dragon, big monsters. Keep them coming. Well done. You wield the Firebird's flames just as a first shield should. You flatter me, my lord. Or would you rather I flattened you? Can be arranged. Oh, I was a bird very, very briefly at the start as well. Uh, there was that wasn't explained. I don't understand why I was a bird. Count for naught if you don't live long enough to use it. On your toes, Lord Rossfield. I turn the volume up a little bit. The dialogue's a bit low, isn't it? So I need to evade. I want to evade. Evading attack at the present moment. Okay, so I can do a perfect evade. Oh. Let's try and get it perfect. No. He he. He reels back just slightly longer than I, I keep thinking he's going to. Remember, Clive, your blade is not your only weapon. Quickness of thought and fleetness of foot are indispensable arms in any shield's arsenal. But you are not just any shield, are you? Show me what sets you apart from the rest. You have been blessed by the Phoenix. Granted the use of its power. Call upon that power now to close on me. Okay. Well, I'm waiting. Yeah, I'm waiting. For, I'm waiting too. Hang on. There we go. Uh, the blessing of the Phoenix grants Clive the ability to perform feats of inhuman strength and dexterity. Phoenix Shift is one such iconic feat. All right, so I can teleport with Circle. When you say bird, we are a Phoenix. Yeah, but I don't think I'm a Phoenix in the main game. That's. I think that maybe is where the plot happens. I think I'm a different, I turn into a different thing normally. Or maybe I turn into multiple things. I don't know. I have watched multiple trailers for this game and they've, done, they've all done a very bad job of explaining what the plot is. So I thought I'd play the demo and maybe I'd figure it out. Good. Fly at your foe before he can raise his gun. Look at that. Impressive. But even the most agile shield cannot hope to escape every blow. And death may come by a handful of cuts as easily as it comes by a thousand. There is only one way to ensure... Oh, death by a thousand cuts sounds fall. awful. Keep your wounds mended and your energies replenished. It's like someone goes at you with a piece of paper. Speaking of which, my lord, you seem a little worse for wear. Now that won't do at all. Mend your wounds. I'm gonna just just shimmy. I don't want to make myself much smaller. I'm just gonna shimmy to the side slightly, just covering like the tip of a couple of letters. Uh, all right. So consumables on my D-pad. Let's go. Uh, high potion. Yeah, you go. That's better. Battle is a succession of pivotal moments. Wherein life and death can be decided at a single stroke. You must be ready to utilize every tool at your disposal if you are to navigate a path to victory. Or at the very least, to ensure that you live to fight another day. Enough practice. It's time for the test. You've recovered from your soaking, I trust. You wouldn't want to kick a man while he's drowned. I thought that was what Mormons I did. Never ask. Come then, Lord Rossfield. Spar with me. 
If you believe yourself worthy to be called Shield of the Flame, then prove it. As you wish, my lord. I understand why I took damage over in soaking. That's, that's no way to spend your time. How that, me boy? Make proof of your strength. Okay, can I, can I lock on to you? I'm, I'm going to try locking on to you. Breaking an opponent's will. Just yell insults at him. Go on, you're sure to beat him this time. You can do it, Clive. Just stay calm. Oh no, hang on. I'm trying to dodge. Not quite. Oh. Ah. I'm taking this serious. I'm trying to dodge with my going, my Clive. attack dash thing. I have broken his will. Lord Morduk's will has been broken, leaving him staggered. Use R2 to go to execute rising flames. Okay, let's try not to kill the man. Okay. Can I do that again? Now oh, whatever. Bonk him on the head! Well, it's time I took my own advice. And used all the tools at my disposal. Beaten by a child! How could I? Oh, they added lyrics to the final, to the to the victory fanfare. I mean, I, I don't know what language they're in. They might just be gibberish. Ba da da da, bum bing bang ga dum. You beat up a guy. Well do done, do you, it. Clive. That's what it translates to. Bested at last. It's taken me long enough. That was a display worthy of your father. You are a true shield of the flame, and let no one tell you otherwise. Including me. And I have been saying it a lot behind your back. What are you lot gawping at? Back to your drills. Cool. <sighs> Don't need another potion. <sighs> Sure. I was just tired. The Phoenix's flames are a gift. You mustn't waste them. It isn't a waste. My shields look after me. Why shouldn't I? <coughs> That's why. You were coughing this morning, too. You shouldn't be outdoors. I'll be fine. It's just a cold. Don't push yourself. His grace has returned! Father's back! I think that's my brother and sister. Your Grace, please, uh, this is no place for one such as you. I would gladly brave hell itself to see my darling boy. Hi, Father. Gentlemen, Rosaria thanks you for your indefatigable loyalty. Thank you, Your Grace. We live to serve. Joshua. You should not be out of doors. We have discussed this. I thought she was going to backhand I'm sorry. Him. Good day to you, Mother. Come, Joshua. Your father will be expecting us. Oh, okay. Hmm. Lord Murdoch? Your Grace. Oh, maybe I'm like illegitimate or something. What a way to treat your own flesh and blood. I know. But it's not his fault. Not everyone can be born the Phoenix. Oh, that's why. I'm not a bird. 
We should join them. I'm the Jon Snow. That is a reference that I will not get. Do you mean the BBC? Do you mean the Channel 4 newscaster? Ah, oh, hell yeah. I think this might be a chocobo. I mean, that's not a chocobo. That's a man. That's a chocobo. Yes, obviously. Okay, good, good. I just glad we're on the same page. Yes, okay. I am. I am Jon Snow, the the the, the Channel Four newscaster. Rise, my friends. Who's Moira Stewart? Welcome home, Father. Oh, thanks, uh, Kirsty Young. Did she used to do the news? You are well, I trust. Yes, Father. Much better. Today, Jill and I went to the bay to watch Clive Spark. Could be the bastard son of a Game of Thrones. Well, so? you'd know I wouldn't get a Game of Thrones reference. So. Quiet. Yeah. Stop it, boy. Not now. You'll make a fine hound one day. Father. Lift up your head, girl. Thank you, Your Grace. So the dog is the one thing I'm kind of like, okay, I like the dog, because I know that you, you get Tall Girl is one of your party your members, I think, in the future. It's just a lot of people and then a dog. Oh, coming, my boy. We must make ready. Like in, uh... Is the situation truly so grave? Grandia 2. Go to the throne room. We will talk there. Yes, Father. Your Grace. Shields dismissed. But yes, this one is very heavily Game of Thrones. Not inspired, but you know, you can tell, you can sort of see that they've gone a bit more Game of Thronesy with this one than. I mean, the last one had a car, so. Where do you think you're going? Hmm? Unhand me! I wanted that butterfly. Here is off to see the Archduke. Right. Even put the dock in. Indeed. Well, you won't get this, but there's a lot of Game of Thrones here. Yeah, I, a lot. I imagine there's a lot that's going, that's just going to go over my head, which is fine. It's, uh, yeah. Should you find yourself lost, do not fret. Just stay still and wait for an adult to find you. Uh, press L3 and trust your animal instinct to point you in the right direction. Your current destination will be displayed with a red symbol. Is trouble brewing? I'm not sure. I need to speak with Father. Okay. I mean, I couldn't. I can make for the throne room, but there are multiple sparklies. Need to shift this lot before we lose the light. Right. There's a. There's a, there's a clear sparkly there. Can I play with the chocobo? More refugees arrived today. Well, if things get crowded, we can walk. Finding items. Get this stuff on. I found a potion. There's a big sparkly up here. <gasps> okay, well, I think we answered our question about whether. Good the me in the future is a slave or a mercenary. Me, Lord Marquess, pray do not concern yourself with this bungling cur. Bow to him, you fool. Uh, 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 I say to speak. It was no trouble, really. Oh, do not indulge him. To be allowed to stand in your lordship's presence is more than his kind deserves. Why, neither the Empire nor the Republic treat their bearers half so well. He was lucky to be born in your father's dominion. 
very lucky as I remind him every day. Stand, please. Stand. I trust his good fortune will continue. Of course, if that is your lordship's wish. Don't work too hard. Remember, it is for the good of the duchy that you serve. Not if you ask his mom, she's unfair. All, yeah. my lord. If you're not, Let's if you can't all. turn into a bird, she doesn't care. Come along now. Back to your duties. <laughs> oh boy, oh, I'm gonna get beaten later. So yeah, the me in the future has one of those tattoos on my face. Which makes you think that at some point during this flashback, something bad will happen. I'm excited to find out what. Looks like they're getting ready for supper. <laughs> I think someone's hungry. Oh, it's a water crystal. Okay, that's what that is. There was someone earlier who had a water crystal and they were using it to fill up their glass. I don't, I don't know that I trust drinking magic water. I might definitely get someone else to drink it for me first. Fine display, my lord. Almost felt sorry for the Lord Commander. Um, no, I, think it, I don't think there's much else to explore in this area. It's, it's quite a tiny little camp. Plus, this is a flashback, so it's not like I can carry Wait, anything forward to the present again, day. Apparently? Only bit sister turns out to be Shiva. I I reckon sister will die. Uh, other brother will use or uh, I don't know. He's Phoenix, which makes me think that he'll like exhaust his power resurrecting someone. There's Joshua. Because that's like the whole thing with Phoenix. Phoenix is a fire type. Hang on, what's this guy doing? Phoenix is a fire type, but uh, it's the whole thing is like it revives people, doesn't it? My lord, it, it, it's not how it looks. I'm um, inspecting the castle walls by order of the Duchess. M my lord, it, it, it's not how it looks. I'm, uh... Oh, he's he's got gardening powers, so maybe we're not all fire types. There are some grass types. Or maybe we've just employed grass types from the grass nation. That's what they're called in Avatar. Nations. Fire nation and water nation and uh, party nation. Oh, everyone loves the party nation. Well, until the party nation attacked. Then everything changed. Oh, these require extra efforts. I need to press two buttons. The power of the Phoenix dwells within the <laughs> I'd like to say, oh, imagine if you had to do a quick time event every time you opened a door, but there are definitely some door handles that I have fumbled. That I've like not grabbed properly and slipped, or I've caught my sleeve on the door my my wet dressing gown sleeve on the door handle as I've walked past. They are tricky. They are tricky sometimes. So maybe that's just me failing the QTE. You commanded my presence, Your Grace. How may I serve you? All right, you can stop licking my boots. Mother isn't here. Do the territories fare any better? <sighs> Most lie under a pall of black. In just these few moons, the blight has taken nigh on all of the northern reaches. It is only a matter of time. 
before it crosses the border. I have flames. Nearly every available bed in the capital it's is already dark occupied souls, by those it? fleeing the deadlands. Kingdom of flames and the Even blight covering were the land to send in them gloom. South, to Port Isolde, more would only follow in their wake. Every day we delay brings us closer to disaster. We must move now. Against the Iron Kingdom. We have traded blows with them for too long. It is time to end it. Fire is super effective against steel, least, so it does make sense. So we should go against them. Without the blessing of the Mother Crystal, we cannot defend our realm from the spread of the Blight. The Iron Blood will not relinquish it easily. This will be a bitter fight. We ride for Phoenix Gate tomorrow. There we will listen to the words of our ancestors, as tradition dictates. Am I to go with you as Joshua's shield? There is something else I would have you do first. Rodney. You plonker. You will have heard the reports, I am sure, of beastmen from the north being sighted within our borders. Ah, oh, there are beastmen. Oh, still wind marshes. I know of the rumors, yes. Then you know what must be done. I will give you two good men. While we ride north tomorrow, you will journey to Stillwind. Two it good men and okay. one kind of okay then guy. You will join us at Phoenix Gate. It is time to prove your strength and shut your mother up for good. Hmm? <clears throat> I will do my duty, Your Grace. That will be all. Rest well. We ride at dawn. Yes, Your Grace. Time law. Oh, okay. This is just if you forget what you've done. You can just. Oh, okay. That's Dad. Archduke of the Grand Duchy of Rosario and father of Clive and Joshua. Loved by his people for his steadfast leadership both at home and on the battlefield. Which you put to good effect in quelling the rebellious northern territories. Neat. Uh, bed. Should I go I, up here? Is this where I sleep? This is awkward. I have to come through here every day. I have to go to bed. Your dad's meeting with dignitaries. It's like, oh, it's nine o'clock. And I'm, actually, I don't know how old I am. I'm like, I guess like 17 or something. No messages, my lord. 50? Probably 15. That's what time people sort of come of age in medieval stuff, isn't it? People are always taking aim at dawn. Poor dawn. Or, um, uh, Will. Lots of people are always firing at Will. How long will you be away this time? Not long. Four days, maybe five. And you will be taking Joshua? Well, I can't exactly leave him behind, can I? The blood of the Rosfields runs in his veins. Before going to war, we perform the rite at Phoenix Gate. It's our way. You know that. And only the dominant can enter the apothecary, so yes. I'm taking Joshua. Oh, to hell with your way! The boy is ill. You think I don't know that? But the boy is also the phoenix. The heir to the throne. You can't keep him in swaddling clothes all of his life. 
will win. Don't worry. Clive will watch over him. Though he is a youth of but 15 years. I was 15. He's already a fine soldier. He will make a splendid shield. You see more in him than the Phoenix did. He was rejected, Elwyn. Our household has no place for such a failure. He is worthless. A man like any other. As am I, my dear. <laughs> Nonsense. You are the Archduke of Rosaria. Oh, not this again. Will deserves it, Dawn does it. Well, what did Will do to deserve it? You know as well as I do that I only sit upon the throne because my father Dawn was taken be deserved to be taken down a peg. I am merely warming the seat till Joshua comes of age. You are your father's firstborn son, and you sit upon the throne. All is in its right place. We're under an hour, and there's already been two the people having time. sex. You have not. This is Game of Thrones, isn't blood. it? Without men like Clive to keep us safe, your precious noble blood would long since have graced the gutter. Okay, never mind. We have an early start. I'm going to sleep. Don't stab me. You seem like the kind of person to stab someone in their sleep. Don't do that. This is it then. Time to prove yourself. Pretty sure Game of Thrones had nudity in like Wish the first five stop. minutes. There's not been any sort of actual nudity yet. I'm a little old for that. There was a lady wearing leather and a big guy in right. a corridor, but it cut it cut it cut back to us before anything happened. Also, I think he turned into a giant titan, so I don't think any, I, don't, I think maybe nothing happened because he was in a rush. I am Joshua's shield. I'm sworn to protect him. He takes too many risks. I only wish I could save him from himself. Clive, you... I have another mission too. Father has given me my first command. Well, if you're not going to pray to Metia for your safe return, I shall just have to do it for you. Which one's Metia? The moon or the red dot next to it? Oh, is it Meteor? Is it like Meteor? I guess I, I guess Meteor is technically a summon. There's going to be another war, isn't there? Since coming here, I've begun to take peace for granted. I assumed the war between our nations would be the last. But it never really ends, does it? No. The next war will be bigger than before. But you'll be alright, won't you, Clive? You're a shield of Rosaria, after all, and blessed by the Phoenix. Okay, I, I, I really hope this isn't my sister. It's getting cold. We should go in. My lady. <laughs> Good night, Clive. We don't, we don't need that part of Game of Thrones. Thank you very much. So I, I, in all the trailers I've seen, they've all been—it's all been all the cool summons, you know, like Titan, Shiva, Ifrit, Phoenix. I want to—I—I—I really hope that there are some people who are the personification of like the really silly summons. 
Like, I want to see the guy who turns into fat chocobo. I'll be hunting today. Don't worry. I'm sure you'll do brilliantly. Mm, I'll try. <laughs> Good luck! It would be great if there was one guy who's, who's like, I'm Meteor. I can turn into Meteor once. Kind of a, kind of a final strat, you know, last ditch strategy, I've got to be honest. Friends, we ride for Phoenix Gate. May the blessing of the crystals go with us. And shield the fireless flame forevermore! As Grace departs, open the gates! I'm surprised considering their clan is like. Lord Rossfield, allow me. Has like red. Thank you. What, what would you call it? Red. Uh, they got red flags, red colour scheme. They don't know their chocobos are red. We're ready to depart, my lord. May I say what an honour it is to serve alongside you? So these are the two good men. Where's the one mediocre guy? Is he late? Did he sleep in? Investigation. <sighs> Typical. If there are goblins in Stillwind, they won't leave willingly. The beastmen are a fierce foe. We underestimate them at our peril. Not today, we won't. So wait, Sir Tyler. Let us do our duty. With pleasure, my lord. As you command. To the marshes, then. I think that's you, dude. Hey! I, I, I'm blessed by the phoenix. The crystals go with us. I can teleport. I'm a cool dude. I'm not Steve. All right, here we are. The world map displays all the locations indicated by glowing pins. Currently available to Clive via fast travel. Neat. Okay. Now we're in a forest. We're going to fight goblins. Keep your eyes open for those goblins. Looks the like you need to hit up a few light routes. Yeah, the map's very. It's all swamps from here. Very Watch grayed step, out, my lord. <laughs> and everything else. Watch your stuff, my lord, and also your perfectly, perfectly quaffed hair. Timely accessories. Feeling overwhelmed? Try equipping one of the more, one or more of the five timely accessories. For example, the Ring of Timely Strikes allows its wear. Oh, so yeah, this is. Uh, I had a choice between playing uh, like action orientated or story orientated. I think the difference is, is that story orientated, all of these are equipped as uh, default. Um, so basically, if you find yourself struggling with one of the mechanics, you can equip an accessory that ba that means Not the game exactly will kind of just well do it for you. Path. But who do you Which is a nice accessibility it? thing, you know. Not everyone is as good at parrying as I am. It's hard to believe that anyone used to live here. The old village of Stillwind is ahead. Not that there's a lot left of it. Where's the body? Am I so desperate for cash that I'm gonna start? I'm gonna go, go, go ooh, two gil! Look, sir, you are. <laughs> you're part of the royal family, and that is money in a swamp. It's like, if you say, those who look after the pennies, if they, the pounds will save. If you look after the pennies, the pounds will save themselves. It's like, oh, okay. I didn't realize the house Rosario was doing so badly. Oh, 
Oh yeah, those are some proper goblin looking goblins. They've made for themselves. With me. Loin cloths and hats. That's all we need. Those are the, the, the those were the end two important in parts. Use triangle after striking the opponent with scuds to under a magic explosion that deals significant damage. Oh, okay. Hang on. I'm, <laughs> I'm trying to do it, but it's not working. I'm just. I'm just hitting them and then firing magic. So the reports are true. We should press on. There may be more ahead. Yes, let's slaughter the lot of them. Filthy creatures. I can, I can dope, I can, I can dope myself. Welcome to Stillwind. Of care, my lord. This music is quite jocular for uh, assassinating goblins in the swamp. There's more. There we go. I did it that time. Oh, hang on. So many of you. Okay, that's fine. There we go. Now I'm magic bursting. I think you guys need to pour your weight a bit more, though. Like, I know we can't all be burst by the Phoenix, but at the same time, come on. Swing your arms a bit. Put your back into it. Bend your knees. Oh, the that the the P it's difficult to explain. Uh, the PS5 controls. So when I held down RT, when I pressed X, it like stopped me from holding it all the way down. And then when the board broke, the RT it like gave. That was that quite nice. Leon Kennedy, if he had a sword. I like these magic butterflies constantly showing me the way as well. Watch out, my lord. Some of their number of spells. And what a number. We'll all have our hands full here. I can sling spells better than they can. MP bar, do I? Let's try that. Let's jump. That's my Phoenix charge, yeah. Like, if I. If I spam fire, I'm not. Yeah, I'm not using up any magic. I suppose they haven't given me any ethers, so. Yeah, that's, that's quite nice. It's like there's a little bit of resistance um, holding down R2, and then when you press X to actually kick it down, it gives. We 
should be nearing the old village square. Plus, it's quite it generous on the timing. Nest of goblins. How did we let a village this close to our kingdom get this overrun with goblins, by the way? Oh, it's messed up my hair. Sneaky sods. We're trapped. My lord. I mean, this is fewer. This is fewer than the last. I mean, just kill them all. This is. He's the leader. Oh, he's got a ma he's got a magnificent hat. That's how you can tell. Take care of his followers first. Care to thin the herd? As if you have to ask. Flash. <laughs> the golden was just after a while, just like, okay, well, it is hurting, but it's, it, I mean, you, I'm getting used to it now. Oh, they've got a hob. On your feet, Sir Wade. Here it comes. Larger enemies must be faced with caution. They have, yeah, blah, use a blah, 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 stagger. Founder, that's a swing and a half. Be ready to move when it winds up for another. Then have to tell me twice. I need to break his will. I mean, again, not the will deserves it. Him, lads. Right, break his will again. Ooh. Just I parried that. That was a perfect dodge. Oh, I might be I might be okay at this game. I'm trying to get the magic burst reliably on that last hit, but Oh, it's a Gigas. I figured it was a Hobgoblin. We got nothing. Oh, I leveled up though. That's nice. Good for me. Oh wait, no, I did get something. Following important battles, a separate result screen will appear displaying battle performance. I got his armlets. Can I equip them? Where, where, where was... What was he... What did he have the armlets on? Because they weren't on his arms. Maybe it's best not. The question best not asked. Come back and fight, you coward! After him, before he summons the rest. Uh. Yep. Hey. I don't. 
feel like I need the, the tutorial for all of this. A lot of it's like, this is the this is the gear tab. This is where you equip gear. And it's like, uh huh. There he is. Damn it. I mean, I can, yeah, just run over this. Why am why am I why am I so so bad at aiming? This ends now. Are we gonna find another boss? It's a Marlboro! We can we cannot defeat a Marlboro at level six. Keep clear of its war, my lord. That it's... thing's breath is worse than its bite. It's like 50% more. Maybe we can defeat this at level 5. I thought maybe this was going to be one of these things we were like, we had to run away from. Take us a little while. It's not. We're not doing a huge amount of damage to it. Where's it going? Your guess is as good as mine. <laughs> oh, hang on. When the screen flashes blue like this during a pivotal moment in battle, press square. Give me quite a lot of time to, to do that. Can we just can I just can we just keep doing that? Like can, when he gets back up, can you just jump and hit it in the head again? This, this occurs to me like a good time to use that strength potion I picked up. I think the combat does get a bit more dynamic in the like present day once we get out of the prologue. So at the moment it's very much I appreciate it's very much just square, 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 triangle. Cannot fall here. Oh we did a different thing. Press R1 before the time runs out. Oh no! I did it! Oh it was tight. But I managed it. Now for the final push, my lord.
I did a flip. I think we've made it angry. I'd rather we made it die. Oh, that is that is a one-liner on par with some of mine. Stay out of its way when it's rampaging. Almost got it. You did it again, you killed the mobile. Just translating. It's different each time. It, it's context dependent what they sing. I didn't get any braces that time. My lord. Thanks. Never thought I'd see it. Not just goblins in Rosaria, but morbles too. I'll petition His Grace to send a detachment. If we don't stop them here, they'll be at our gates before long. We should get moving. We don't want to be caught out here after dark. If we set off now, we can still reach Phoenix Gate before nightfall. I did it. Unless... Damned blight. So I guess the blight is making the monsters like move out of the. Because he said he was. The morbles don't normally appear here. So I guess the blight is making them. moving them out of their normal habitat. Still, though, it's pretty irresponsible to let. Um, like, that village is really close to where. to, uh, to here. And that's like a. that looks like a main road. I like this map though. I need to see more of it, but it looks like it's like it looks like a model rather than CGI. Eh, I don't know. All right, let's go to Phoenix Gate. I'm sure everything is fine. Oh, okay, no, everything is fine. Suddenly, thousands of red eyes. No, wait till you hear this. Wait till you hear this. His lordship draws his sword. The goblin chief runs off screaming. Straight down on Marvel's gut. I, I, I wouldn't. That's not how I would have told that story. I would have. I would have. I would have built the marble up more. The young lord has a bright future ahead of him. Aye, and one of these nights he may even deign to join us. Father, why are they doing that? It's like, honestly, I have no idea. Are They're kind man? of dim. No, Father. Just a little tired. Well, it has been a long day. They all like Clive, don't they? Aye. Hmm, Your brother will be a fine shield. We're all very proud of him.
father. Why is it that the Dominus is always born into our family? Doesn't seem fair. We cannot live without the blessing of the crystals. And the crystals work their magic through us. You have been blessed, Joshua. Blessed to be a dominant, to wield the power of an icon. Our family has been chosen to share that power with the people. So that is what we must do. With great power comes great responsibility. Jill, she'll be wondering where you've got to. So much for you being a fine hound. So this is where you've been hiding. What are you doing out here? I didn't see you at the feast. Feasts are the only time shields are allowed to take their ease and... I've never really been one for cakes and ale. It's the vegetables I don't like. <laughs> also, I, I'm tone deaf. <laughs> they always insist on singing that bloody song. I hear you slew a marble. All the men were singing your praises. They never used to. When I joined the ranks, everyone thought I was a spoiled little lordling. If I didn't know how to handle a sword, I'd be a laughing stock. The Archduke's firstborn failure. You're the one they really believe in. I'm jealous. That's not true. They don't believe in me. They believe in the power of the dominant. My brother, the Phoenix, ruler over life and death. It isn't fair. It should have been you. I don't have what it takes to lead our people. I don't have the strength, but you do. Every man has his duty. Ours was decided long ago, when our ancestors chose to instate the Dominant as the Archduke of Rosaria. All to ensure that whenever our nation stood on a precipice, the Phoenix would rise from the flames to drag us back from the brink. The fate of Rosaria sits on the Dominant's shoulders. It is your duty to bear that burden. What about you? I was born to be your shield. That is why I was given the Phoenix's blessing. To keep our future rulers safe. No matter what. However hard it gets. I'll never let you down. I'll never give you up. Thank you, Clive. I know you'll always take care of me. <laughs> I'm gonna give you up. Or Before I can you. do that, you need to take care of yourself. Or 
right? I should go inside. It's past my bedtime. Good night, Torgal. Why did you wake me, human? I was napping. Is it time for walkies? All right, well, things have been going all too well for too long, so the, the shit's got to hit the fan soon. from the capital. This feels like a Trojan horse thing. You took your time sampling the wearers, were you? <laughs> Good job the North is full of enterprising traders keen to keep us in wine. Spare a barrel for the boys on duty, eh? What in the... Yeah. I feel like I should have had slightly more stringent checks. Under forever. Hey, we secured, Captain. We proceed as planned. Forgive me, my prince. It's me, Wade. You probably don't remember me. I remember. What is it? We're under attack. I don't know who they are, but they've set light to half the castle. I must get you to safety, your highness. Very well. I'm ready. Oh, I don't. I don't think Wade's going to last very long. Oh, I'm, I'm. I'm. I'm this guy now. Joshua. That's his name. Joshua keeps giving me Hugo vibes. Not this full bit. Make me just like him. Do you know? No, actually, I was going to say. I, I think it might even be the same voice actor, but I don't think it is because Hugo was French, wasn't he? Are the enemy already inside the castle? He just has. A, he sounds like British Hugo. You're right. He, he's a lot less... He, it, well, he's a lot more aware of his situation, though. Where he's just like, you know, they don't like me. They just like my power. Um, and, you know, I'm weak. It should have been you. He is a bit of a whiner, I suppose. What was that? I have to help them. Woo! Alright, you're gonna make me open the door, are you? On fire. Fall back, your highness! He's not one of us! No, I must do my duty. Oh, but I get I, I can use magic attacks, but I get tired afterwards. Oh sort 
them at the feast. They were laughing. This is Sambra Quarkarp. But why would the Empire... We must find my father. It really... I, I mean, I'm, I'm probably misremembering because I'm sure he was French. But it really does sound like Hugo's voice actor. Special attacks were getting tired, definitely Hugo. Yeah. Yeah, he did get, like, all exhausted after using his rap rapnomancy. Do it all. Bastards are everywhere. Like literally, Why I can. Why does the Empire do this? They're our allies. I'll die. Maybe it's not our Empire. Maybe it's someone dressed like the Empire to make us think the Empire has betrayed us. When in actuality, it's a different faction that hasn't been introduced yet because it's still quite early on. And, but, you know, intrigue, political intrigue and deception, Game of Thrones, songs of fire and ice. I am the Dominant! <laughs> we work quite well together, me and Wade. I blow him up, he knocks him down. As long as we don't get attacked by more than one or two enemies at a time, I think we'll be okay. If three come at us, I think we might be done. Tyler! Oh, no, not Tyler. Damn it! His wounds are deep. I can save him. Phoenix down! Your Highness, I... You're going to be all right. I'll hold them off. It is the same kid, is it? I thought it. I thought it sounded like Hugo. I guess he was just putting on a French accent. It's a good voice actor. I mean, I'm not going to be wrong. He's, Your Grace, he's, he's, a, he's a good fit for the role. You rescued the young prince. Well done, Sir Wade. I'm in your debt, soldier. Thank you, Your Grace. Cannot stay here. We should make straight for the rear gate. Tyler, you good? Is Tyler good? Oh yeah, Tyler's fine. On the lost Alan, to a son Gelif. May the winds speed you to Rosalith. I was in Hogwarts Legacy, apparently. The gate to my head. There are chocobos in the stables. Father, take Joshua and get to safety. No, I'm not going without you. I guess I'll have to play Taylor. Be shield, remember? Got a lot of work. I remember, which is why I'm going to hold the enemy here while you make your escape. I will order a remaining force. To be fair, I don't think he's going to be in this game for very long. Because even if he doesn't die here, we are going to. This is a flashback to 13 years in the past. And I think it'd be weird if he's still got that same duty. voice in 13 years. Let's do your duty too.
have to keep father safe. I'm counting on you, Joshua. It was the last time I saw Joshua. <laughs> I failed the door in QTE. This man. Everyone's dead. Uh. One again? Over here. I may have come back the way I came. Yep. Damn it all. He's a big one. Let none escape. I feel like I'm really underdressed wearing my leather jacket <laughs> compared to these guys. You take care of that spell I'll keep the others occupied. Wait, was I? Down with you! Okay, I'm gonna be honest, I thought the captain would put up would, would have like at least a stagger bar. That's them done. Are you alright? I'm fine. It's my father and Joshua I'm worried about. We should head back. <gasps> oh look at this hero. Hey, look out! It's a dragoon! This dance. Night of the Blinding Dawn. And you are the shield who was blessed by the Phoenix. Not that it will save you. Won't hinder me. Ow. Oh, it might hinder me a little bit. Ow. Okay, he's quite, quite strong. Stay still, damn you! Yeah, seriously. I'm getting the occasional perfect dodge on him, but. Follows up with the whirlwind attack. Oh, he 
He's doing a thing. He's open. I boshed him. Now, Clive, have at him. To regret that boy. Which boy? Oh, he, oh he's, he's hopping about now. Ow. Back. We're out of sight. Around that. Ow. Ow. He's almost broken. Aha. Dude, he's. Help me! Hopefully, there isn't much more after this because I'm out of high potions now. I got quite good at dodging him, though. There you go. You cut down the cool dragoon guy. That's the voice of Estinian. Oh, is it? Oh, that that is entirely suitable then. That is that is absolutely appropriate. I would not be surprised if there were quite a lot of Final Fantasy XIV voice actors in this, because you know, are you hurt? You got to get them in anyway. You might as well get them in to do FF16 voices. Like, hey, Estinian, we got a dragoon guy. He dies in. He dies immediately. If you want to do some voice lines for him. Do they really mean to invade us? Not yet. Their numbers were too few. They were not here to take the castle. They were here to take heads. Our work is done. We should return to my father. My lord, look. We issued these sashes, but yesterday. In Rosalith, if they were already among us, what if there were others? Father and Joshua are in danger. We must hurry. Take your steed. Oh. Oh, now, now we have to wonder who to trust. What is that? Oh, and it wouldn't, it wouldn't be a Final Fantasy protagonist without the, without the occasional mysterious headache. Reunion. Well then, as you were. Oh, all right. Thank goodness. Your Grace, is everyone safe? For the moment. We ride for Rosalith to rally our forces. I will need your help to see Joshua safely back to the capital. On you get Joshua. Oh, what did the Chocobo do? Father? I'm sorry, Your Grace, but that won't be possible. Oh, what did the Owl do? You are the little snakes! Stay back! I'm warning you! Run, Joshua! Run! No! Hey. Oh. That was sudden. Wait! No! You must 
do you what you need to. You have to keep Father safe. I have to. I had to. Yeah, past tense. Go on, blow him up. I was like, oh god, we let him go full anime protagonist. Things keep happening to the awful chock of us. Thank you, God. You saved my life. They're all just trying to be good birds. Please. I like chock of us, and I like seeing bad things happen to them. Oh, I'm now. I'm now beginning to think the scene from the the bit from right at the start where I, I was a bird. I was playing as Joshua, and. I am. Maybe I uh, maybe I didn't have the Phoenix blessing. I had Ifrit's blessing. That's impossible. Oh no! I I incinerated my friend. Fight of the star. We have context. And now we have life bars. Uh, Alright, fire, aim, evade. So I'm, I'm trying to kill myself. This is weird. Bad matchup. Like it's a fire type versus a fire type.
okay. If there's if there's a lot of boss battles like this, like like these cool sort of cinematic battle icon fights, I go I could I could get hyped for this. Bad place to have a fight. Have to, to be fair, I feel like I'm doing most of the damage. Like Joshua is blowing up a lot more. Like Clive's just jumping around. I'm the one blowing shit up. Oh, actually, no, I suppose he is blowing the lot. He is knocking stuff over by jumping around. Woo. Oh, untouchable, baby. There you are. Where you are. There you are. Where you are. Life is really bad at this. I don't know, I got a timer. Come on! I did all those prisoners and dodges! You accidentally beat up your brother and doomed your castle! Well, hopefully we didn't destroy the foundations of our kingdom too badly. Oh. Guys, like I can't believe the day I'm having. Life is just really bad at being an icon. <laughs> No! 
hard to red phoenix down that one. Murder. I'll kill you! I'll fucking kill you! Quite a mess that monster made. Damn shame about the Phoenix, but can't be helped. Oh, my condolences, Your Grace. Is there aught we can do? <laughs> Haven't you done enough, Captain? Joshua was my world, and now he is gone. I can only pray there will be a place for me in the world his radiance seeks to create. Oh, the mum was the traitor. I see. Your Grace, over here. The rubble must have protected him from the worst of the flames. Shall we take him prisoner? No need for that. Kill him. Hmm. All right. Wait. As my husband never tired of telling me, he is a fine soldier. I'm sure he would make an excellent addition to the Imperial front line. All in its right place. this one okay <laughs> chin up lad you're going to be a soldier she's gonna need a murdering later Joshua. like a real good one that's not the end of the demo by the way that's just we just hit the title I think it's, and it's the end of the prologue I think there's, there's, there's definitely more demo, I promise. I know it definitely looks like the end of the demo, but there is more demo. Uh, I know it says you have completed the Final Fantasy XVI demo, but there is more demo. Uh, I think that's the bit that carries over. So when I... Yeah, so I can create a save file, and I can c continue on from that save um, if I buy the game. I got I, I gotta be honest that I am kind of in, invested in into it now like that did a lot more to get me interested in the game than the trailers did because the trailers are just lots of like random bits of drama whereas that actually sort of I kind of want to kill the mum <laughs> so sending Jon Snow to the Night's Watch how how have they ripped rip, Game of Thrones stuff this much. It's it's Japanese. Uh, I will not purchase it yet. So the icon iconic challenge has been unlocked is now available from the title menu. In this special mode set later in the game, Clive has been equipped with the feats and abilities of three unique icons: the Phoenix, Garuda, and Titan. What happened to Ifrit? So you better feel the Final Fantasy is an exciting battle system. So yeah, so that's like the the, the bit that so I'll get that I, I'll carry on from there. But then there's the iconic challenge. Uh, so, Conic Trans puts in control of Clive several hours into the story, equipped with the feats, abilities, not one, but three powerful icons. Channels were created specifically for this demo, and its features differ slightly from what appears in the final game. So, 30 years have passed since tragic adventure with Scythe Claw robbed, that's all Clive robbed from, of his father, of his brother, his father, and his home. After being pressed into service for the Imperial Army of Sandbreck, Clive earns his freedom with the hands of a man named Sid. Every Final Fantasy has to have a Sid. 
It's like Bioshock and Lighthouses, who agrees to aid our hero in his search for the answers that have eluded him for so long. We join the two as they begin their infiltration of Kaer Norvent, an ancient stronghold wherein his brother's supposed killer, a second dominant of fire, is said to be held by an elite party of where loader knights commanded by Benedicta Harmon. Oh, so maybe I didn't turn into Ifrit. Maybe the other, the guy there turned into Ifrit. And I was seeing the action through the dog. I, I guess. Or maybe I did, and I'm in denial. I'm not sure. One of our sentries has failed to report, milady. Your orders? Pull the men back inside the care, Geralt. He is here, then. Have them lead Sid and his little pet to the chapel. I shall entertain them there. <sighs> so you've come for me after all. I, yes. As it happens. So yeah, now I'm now I'm now I'm twenty-eight and I have a tattoo. And my dog's older. Headwind. L2 to cycle between currently attuned icons in real time, allowing for more varied assault. Cool, then times for iconic abilities displayed around the craftsman icon in the ability widget. Abi <laughs> I like that. Uh, ability availability of all attuned icons can be confirmed with the color dots for the right. Okay. That's a nice trick. You'll have to teach me sometime. I, I don't know who you are. So I've got Garuda, Titan, and Phoenix as my currently. So I can do Wicked Wheel and Gouge as Garuda. Stone and Wind Up. I guess that's like Taunt. And Scarlet Cyclone and Rising Flames. And then I can do the... That's my Phoenix one. Oh, it's like a range. Yeah, that's just that. And that's like a range. Oh, I think that's... I think that might be a grab. That looks like a claw, so that might be a, gr a grab. Oh, and this is a sheet. This is Titan. I can block with this. Okay, this is kind of cool. So I guess I can only. Ha I guess I can have three. Yeah, on a time, and then I can just change them around. Some of the fiery wing. That's the one we had as. Uh, ba -ba 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 -ba, as Joshua. And then, oh, I like. Hang on, I'll tell. Hang on, let me let me invisible myself. Look, look at my party members. They got their little pixel Final Fantasy One sprites. That's cute. Uh, spin quickly. Summon twin claws that relentlessly tear at the target. Can be used in midair. Perform a rising attack, striking on enemies. Punch. Punch. Okay. How do I? Oh, I'm going. We do photo mode. Why did they? This gave me. This, I just had a better weapon in my inventory, and they just didn't tell me about it. Yeah, I just have... There you go. I've optimized my gear. Do I recommend my abilities as well? Look at that. Oh, okay. This is a little Final Fantasy X, isn't it? Hey, salutations, Briar. What's stop me? Hello, Jack. Hope you're dandy today. I am very dandy today, thank you. Good to see you. You've unfortunately missed the uh, 
the prologue part, where you skip to the, like, bit where the, they just let you kind of play around with the gameplay a little bit. Oh, we have a Lionheart tonic. Okay. Um, I want to watch the Capcom thing, which starts in, like, nine minutes. So what we'll do is we'll put, we'll pause this, we'll watch the Capcom thing, and then we'll play a little bit of this. I, th I don't think we'll finish this. Um, I wish there was a way I could... S I wanted to see if I could see my dog. But I don't think I can look at party members. Like... Yeah, I don't think there's any way that I can... Oh, wait, wait, wait. Hang on, hang on. Oh, he's looking... Be, be bow wows. I can't actually click on my party members. Oh, it's Sid. That's Sid. Okay. You were eating. You're cool, but bakes... Baked zitty is baked zitty. I don't know what that is. But yes, you are right that it is the thing that it is. There's, there's no denying that. Um, I do have 1,800 ability points. I could buy some things. Just, like, randomly. In fact, hang on. 800. Two, I could just buy... I don't have to just buy all of these. There you go. Oh, I could have bought some of these. <laughs> well... Hang on, if I if I reset all ability points, and then I can turn on recommended ability points. And I have 65 left. Cool. I should be, like, all set up now. But yes, we shall pause this. Um, and we shall go and watch the Capcom event. And then we will come back. Um, because I want to see if there's going to be Resident Evil DLC. And... Uh... And that's basically it. That's, that's the only thing I really care about. There might be some other stuff in there that's, uh, that's worth watching. Let's get the showcase up. Peggy 18. Oh, it's, it literally started as I clicked on it, but it's still got... It still says it's starting in five minutes, so I don't know what this is. But let me, uh... Monster Hunter Go? says it is. Zitty baked with sausage and covered in cheese sauce. I, I, I still don't know what Zitty is, but okay. Yeah, mobile games. But I mean, at least they're getting the mobile games out of the way. Like, it doesn't start for another four and a half minutes. So at least they're getting the mobile games out of the way early. Type of pasta. Ah, okay. It's a type of pasta. Great. And that sounds delicious. I mean, yeah, sausage cheese pasta. That's that's one of the staples of my diet. Oh, they're putting the remakes on Switch. I I kind of missed what this was when the. Uh, down just a little bit. I, I kind of... Oh, I also realised... There we go. I have my speakers on. That was why... I thought that sounded louder than it normal. There we go. There we go. Hey, salutations, Jin. Good to see you. We're just we're just waiting for the Capcom showcase to start. I told you. 
I'm gonna get you home safe. Well, we've been enjoying Final Fantasy 16 all afternoon. Evening, you were. I am. Um, I don't know, actually. I've still. It's game time. I'm a lot more. <coughs> like I said, I'm a lot more invested in it than I was from watching any of the trailers. I, I, I got. I guess I'd have to play a little bit of like the actual combat, which we'll do after the Capcom showcase. To see whether I like the actual combat. If, if it, the bit I the bit I played during the prologue though felt very nice. Um, nice. This is different from the other ones. The, yeah, it's this one's very Game of Thrones. They very very heavily borrowed. Um, a lot of inspiration from Game of Thrones in this one. Like, it is... You know how Final Fantasy XII borrowed a lot from Star Wars? Th that, but with Game of Thrones. If you're unfamiliar, Final Fantasy XII is, is the main cast of basically Star Wars characters, and they fight against a load of Darth Vader's. It is quite blatant. Also, but Chewbacca is a bunny girl. Which is, I mean, honestly, an improvement. Make Mega Man Legends remake Capcom, goddammit. Hey, Battle Network, uh, uh, the compilation. I, I friggin' love Mega Man Battle Network 1 and 2. I, only, I, ne I never played... I think I played a little bit of the, one of the third ones, because... But they, after the... Ugh, that looks gross. No, turn that shit off. Um, I think Mega after Man the second Battle one, Network. they Mega started Secret. doing like Mega Man Battle Network Red and Blue, and I, I, you had to collect both versions of Mega Man to get all of the Mega Mans. And I was like, I don't want all of the Mega Mans. I don't want. I just want. I just want the my Mega. I just want the one Mega Mans. Rise is uh, apparently done now. They, they did their last update for Kid Mirror, uh, Monster Hunter Rise, so now people are like, okay, so when do we get news on Monster Hunter the next one? So that might be in here. But apparently also Capcom very rarely announce anything new during Summer Games Fest, so it will probably just be footage of stuff we already know about, for the most part. Capcom's Resident Evil. Capcom's Resident Evil. Konami is Silent Hill. I don't think Konami have an event. Um. This time. But then, I mean, Konami don't make games anymore, so. They just publish, they just publish them and own the IP to quite a few of people's favourites. So yeah, no, I don't think there's been any Silent Hill off um, in anywhere in Summer Games Fest. I haven't been watching all of it, but I've been keeping an eye on bits of it. I'm gonna turn my turn my controller off. I'm not I'm not playing the Capcom event. That would be silly. Yeah, it's set to HD. Hello, everyone. Hello, everyone. Welcome to the Capcom Showcase. Oh, has it got its own subtitles? Before we get started, yeah, we'd like to on. share that June 11th, 2023 marked Capcom's 40th anniversary. A big thanks to everyone for playing our games. It's thanks to our amazing fans that we can celebrate such a milestone. We look forward to creating many more games in the years to come, and we hope that you'll continue to enjoy them. Capcom, like, yeah, I mean, I didn't realize it been now around for years. Now it's time to show titles at the Capcom Showcase. They have been knocking out of the park recently. Like, the last few years Stay have been until very the strong so for Capcom. Anything. Let's take a look at this video. Oh, so they announced this at the Xbox event yesterday, I think. This was the thing I thought was Onimusha, but wasn't Onimusha.
In fact, is this the exact same trailer they showed at the Xbox event? Lego Man Legends remake where I burn Jack's new flat to the ground in protest. Hey! What did my flat do? That's... It is. It, it certainly is so far, isn't it? Yeah, I think this is the exact same trailer. Yeah. Okay, well, I mean, you know, it, it's short at least. I mean, I'm definitely not going to buy this game, but it's very nice to look at. Not quite the same traditional trailer, Japanese just, uh, aesthetics. It does have PS5 now on the uh, RE and Steam Experience now on the uh, the end of cards. strategy and action in this epic tale. A beautiful yet unsettling world of mystery awaits in Kunitsugami: Path of the Goddess. Coming to Xbox Series X, Xbox Series S, Windows, PlayStation 5, and Steam. Mega Man X Dive Offline is coming to Steam, iOS, and Android. There you go, Mega Man, mobile games. <laughs> the Deep Log, which holds collected memories of the Mega Man X series, is under attack. Dive into cyberspace. Wait, if they made a Mega Man gadget to recover game. data before it's too late. Play Look, as they... Mega Man X and other characters from the Mega Man franchise, including characters that haven't been playable before. I didn't know Mega Man X had so many waifus. Level up your favorite characters and equipment to create a powerful hunter. Power up your weapons and more to customize your character however you want. It Mega is... Man X Dive Offline. It, it is a gacha game. Control and develop over 100 different characters. Play as a variety of characters, including new heroes created for Mega Man X Dive. Complete stages and use element metals to recover memory pieces. Oh, this is such a recovered mobile game. Characters. Like, this looks like so many mobile games. <laughs> to the point there where I'm like, I, I imagine it probably is a different mobile Challenging game and they've just slapped and Mega Man on top of it. Classic and new stages. I played a, some of that Street Fighter Duel and that felt the, the same way. Build the ultimate hunter and save the deep log Definitely from total gacha, destruction. Yeah. When did Mega Man get waifus is my question. Well, apparently during Mega Man X. But I mean, they always had Roll and uh, Tron Bone. Mega Man X Dive Offline launches in 2023. That's now! Now, here's the Capcom Spotlight Corner. A new era of fighting games is upon us. I've heard of this one. Street Fighter VI launched on June 2nd. It's already received an enthusiastic welcome from fighting game fans around the world. 
Street Fighter VI includes World Tour, an expansive single-player story mode. Yeah, it's fighting fine. Ground, the core fighting game experience made even more accessible. And Battle Hub, a social space where players from around the world can compete and hang out. These are the game's three main modes. In addition, we're planning to release new fighters and content so you can enjoy the game for a long time to come. Yeah, I, I, I saw that fighter pass picture earlier. Xbox and it's only cost, it doesn't cost a huge amount, it's like 250 coins, which I, I think is only a couple of quid. But I looked at it and I thought, there is nothing on this fighter pass that I want. We also have an announcement for Capcom Pro Tour 2023. This year's Capcom Pro Tour will feature Street Fighter VI, the newest entry in the series. I mean, I, I mean honestly, it'd be Players weirder if it didn't. The world will compete in regional matches and battle to be this year's champion. Hey, you know our big new fighting game that to sold 10 million copies or whatever? VI, this year, we're, we're yeah, we're going to skip it. Prize pool ever. The total prize pool for Capcom Pro Tour is over $2 million, with $1 million going to first place. Capcom Pro Tour 2023 will feature three types of tournaments. Online Premiers, Offline Premiers, and World Warrior. The winners of each tournament will advance to the World Finals at Capcom Cup 10. Stay tuned to see which player will crush the competition and take home this year's championship. Next, we have news about Street Fighter League Pro oh. JP 2023. Uh, are they going to have Street Fighter, Fighter 6 as well? World's top players form teams of four and compete in official Capcom Team League matches. We have the largest number of teams ever. The opening match will be held on July 7th and will be streamed live on the Capcom Fighters JP channel on YouTube and Twitch. Mm -hmm. Don't forget about the Street Fighter League World Championship 2023. Oh, how could I? The US and European leagues will determine the teams that will go on to compete in the World Championship. Get up close and personal with Resident Evil 4 on PlayStation 5. The game's main story will be playable in VR with PlayStation VR 2. I am tempted to get a PSVR 2 Thanks to when the I can afford PlayStation it. VR 2, I've heard very, very good things about it. I was kind of a myth, though, because I've got a PSVR, and the games on it aren't compatible with the PSVR 2. And I just feel like... What if... Do I really want to get a PSVR 2 and games for that if, if they're not going to be compatible with the next one? makes parrying even more intuitive. Experience that says, extreme survival horror firsthand. I feel like replaying all of Resident Evil 4 Resident in VR 4 would be VR exhausting. Is a free DLC they use your knife so much. VR Scary though, I imagine, for anyone who hasn't played Resident Evil 4. Now on to the next game in today's lineup. Trailer for this like two years ago. Now this looks like the kind of Capcom game that I like. Up you go. Sorry, That wasn't the game that I thought it was. There was a game. There was a game. There was someone in the street, and people were floating. Ah, oh, we must further postpone the release of Pragmata. Did they, I didn't realize they postponed it once already. Yeah, it does have some pretty good Vanquish vibes. I need to finish that game. It's almost time for Ghost Trick. Here's yeah, the the Ghost game. Trick. This is a great game if you've never played it. Hello, everyone. I'm Shu Takumi, the original creator of Ghost Trick. 
It's almost time for the game's release, and I can't wait for you to play it. But first, let's get started with this. World premiere. I mean, it's an old game. Like, don't get me wrong, well, Ghost Trick's great, but it, it's like 10 years old. <laughs> Demo. Demo for Ghost Rick is available now for download. The story says a lonely spirit named Cecil. In the course of solving his own murder, he will meet and change the lives of all sorts of people in all sorts of situations. Things may seem unrelated at first, but each person plays a vital role in Cecil's story. And together, their stories will lead him to one ultimate truth. So think of the demo as a doorway, inviting you into a great big mystery. It's been 30 years since we made the original game. And just like oh, 13 season, years I old. Many I've been all the And there were many miracles that occurred during its development. I have no doubt these experiences are what shaped Ghost Trick into the unforgettable game it is. To the team that lovingly folded this game, and to all the fans who have shown so much love towards it, I'm so grateful to all of you. I am thrilled that through this river, Ghost Trick will be available to so many more people around the world. Now, to wait for its release. Uh, and one more thing. I practiced very, very hard for two weeks for this appearance. So, she will be me someday. It will make me very happy if it could speak in Japanese. Okay. I'll keep that in mind, dude. I won't, I won't, I won't speak to you in English. Yeah, so you, you play as a dead guy who can rewind time. From the creator of the Ace Attorney series, Shu Takumi, this classic mystery game is being reborn. One night, a man named Sissel loses both his memory and his life. Using the powers of the dead, he I'm hoping solve the mystery of his they own might death. also announce only clue uh, has is Ace a Attorney Collection 2. A night of mystery because begins anew. A rookie detective Eight a while ago, like a couple of years ago, there was a big Justice. Capcom leak. She too is and Phoenix Wright and 4 to 6 collection was and that was in that leak. Who was I? So it's Why was I killed? Who killed me? And what does it mean that I was given these powers of the dead? Use the powers of the dead to possess and trick items. The controls are easy. Connect Sissel's glowing blue soul to the core of objects to possess them. Possess yeah. the tire. Possess the bowl. So you basically possess have to create like Rube ornament. Goldberg machines. You can then trick the objects you possess. Trick the guitar to play it. What will happen when you trick the cart? Trick the door to open it. Possessing and tricking objects will let you access new areas. Sissel can go back four minutes before someone's death. What happened before her murder? Those clues are hidden. Oh, yeah, Ace Attorney's great. Follow past events in real time. The limit, however, is four minutes. Help people avoid near death predicaments and change their fates. Sissel will face death in many forms. Changing their fates will change the story. And that story must be linked in some way to the mystery of Sissel's death. Wait, was that? No, no. Ghost Trick, <laughs> launching on June 30th, 2023. Demo version available now. Don't miss the pre-order bonuses. Oh, it's See the official it's website for details. <laughs> This is kind of tempting to pick it up. Now on to the next while. game in today's lineup. Yeah, no, Ace Attorney's great. Um, I haven't played all of them. I've played the first four. And I played a bit of... Oh, yeah, here we go. So it's... it's... The fourth one. The fourth one's not great, but it's not bad. 
Objection! So they made HD versions of these games ages ago, but they were mobile. Um, so it's like, please port them to something other than iOS. So I never played Dual Destinies. But I can't have Mega Man Legends. Hey, I mean, there's still... We're, only, we're not even halfway... Well, no, we're about halfway through. We're only halfway through. Framing it as the Apollo Justice trilogy, I gotta be honest. Like, yeah, the fourth game is. I mean, he's in the fifth and sixth game, but they are. They're Dream, more Phoenix Wright games. For the falsely accused. As far as I know, I haven't actually played. Uncover the truth. Now, the fourth, fifth, and sixth mainline Ace Attorney games are being brought together to share the story of Apollo Justice and his allies in the dark age of the law. On Nintendo Switch, PlayStation 4, Xbox One, Windows, and Steam. The colorful character. Oh, if you like Danganronpa, Roma you'll definitely like. Although it's some more. And no, yeah, it's, it's kind of in the same sort of vein. In seven but languages. less. Japanese, English, French, German, Korean, Objection. and simplified Chinese. There is. Uh, voice recordings for the new language. There is a supernatural element. We're to sure the Ace Attorney no games. Objection to everything, including in the a, his partner Apollo can um, Ace channel the undead. Is currently in development for release in early 2024. Oh wow! Look forward that? to okay. more information about this collection. Well, there you future. go. You've got the rest of the year to play through Ace Attorney One, Two, and Three. Next, we have some Capcom news to share. This month marks Capcom's 40th anniversary. As part of the celebration, we've opened a digital theme park called Capcom Town. Take a stroll yes. through the museum okay. to view original artwork and other materials from various titles on display. You can even play a few of Capcom's beloved classics for free. Head on over to the castle to cast your vote in the Capcom elections. Participants will receive a special reward, so don't miss out. Yeah, I, I mean, we I can't I, wait for everyone to enjoy these attractions. I mean, I guess it's, it's fine. Along with the many other fun experiences we've prepared at. Okay, they had it to a jingle. A Capcom I, idea. Yeah, I guess it's fine. To play Resident Evil RE Verse. Our new upcoming title, Exo Primal, and to use the online is, feature. Is Ari Verse still live? Hang on. Oh, that's the one that you came from Resident Evil A. With other I was going to say it was the other one that got shut down, wasn't it? Such as a survey about today's Capcom showcase. We'll release more titles and services compatible with Capcom I, ID soon. I have Reverse Ready installed. Capcom ID. Because it came with Resident Evil A. And then it, it, when it when it finally went live, I loaded it up, and it looked like the saddest game ever, now and I never played on it. Exo Primal ahead of next month's launch. Exo Primal looks interesting. It's on Games Pass, so I'll probably give it a go. Capcom Showcase を ご覧の皆様、こんにちは。Exo Primal Director の平岡です。本日は Exo Primal の最新情報を紹介します。まずはこちらの映像をご覧ください。Exo Primal, A.K.A. the reason we're not doing a Dino Crisis remake. Hello? Just waiting to be 
picked up back in 2040. Intact and hot off the press. The access codes to override Leviathan. You can shut it down. The whole thing. There's the dinosaurs. I got to say that there was more plot. I thought this was a multiplayer the game. Of the future. All this time, Heisel is a side effect of time travel. Let me customize the colors of the visual parts. I mean, I, I'm pretty sure you can yeah, completely customize your uh, your frame, your. And I think they've got like a Street Fighter crossover as well, so you can act, you can make your. I mean, look at this. Your mech it's suit look like uh, Ryu. Well done. You fought desperately and survived. The perfect exosuit development. Oh my god, it's the lawnmower man. Activating massacre module. Summoning Neo T Rex swarm. This is all helping to make a better exosuit. Good hunting, Ace. Yeah, if it honestly, if it wasn't on Game Pass, I would just not care. But presenting my most exciting combat project, the Savage Gauntlet. I think I think it has co-op. So yeah. Oh, I can't. My eyes. My, yeah, thank you. Day one with Xbox Game Pass. There you go. いかがでしたでしょうか。新しい情報がたくさんありましたが、その前に。Stu from ME2. That ball. 三月に開催しました。Google Primal オープンベータテスト版をプレイいただきありがとうございました。I do vaguely remember that. 非常に多くのファンの方にプレイいただき、SNS を通じて多くのフィードバックをいただきました。But... Yes. Oh, is there an open beta? Let's take a look at what you can expect when Exo Primal launches on July 14th. Let's start with the story. Ace, the game's protagonist, is transported to the year 2040 and forced to participate in a never-ending series of war games. The story unfolds as you play through Dino Survival, the game's main mode. Gathering intel to update the analysis map unravels the mysteries surrounding parallel worlds and the AI entity known as Leviathan. At times, players will also engage in special boss battles as part of the main story. Dino Survival mode will also change as the story progresses. You'll unlock new missions with a variety of objectives, including 10-player co-op, a multitude of dinosaurs to fight, and more maps. I'm gonna miss the guy doesn't sound that excited. He's like, yeah, you wanna look uh, template co-op, uh, dinosaurs, modules you know, can be used stuff, to enhance exosuits and modify active skills. These modules can be obtained by fulfilling certain conditions while you play the game. You can also personalize your appearance with a variety of cosmetics. Such as exosuit skins, weapon skins, decals, and emotes. The game yeah, also yeah, features my robot, a special uh, five don't robot, but Iron Man chance. Weekly. Compete with squads from around the world for the fastest completion times, or by earning awards through achievements like most damage. Is Hot Tech said rather play Armored battle. Core? No, no. I, I the thing is though, there this is exosuits and Armored Core is giant robots. Completing the main and stories. Exosuits are fine, but giant robots are cooler. I will also probably play Armored Core because uh, I've never played an Armored Core game before. And uh, actually, no, I have played one. But also, I love Rubicon. 
ご期待ください that's, that's my justification. ここから映像でご覧いただいた最新情報をお伝えします Plus, I can make jokes about it not being like Dark Souls. Meet Dr. Signs, the developer of the exosuits. I knew that Exos Primer was going to be quite a big portion of this based on showcase because it's their next big game. The Stratovator, a space elevator that extends from the Anchor Division research facility into orbit, will also be a playable map. Incredible battles will unfold while exo fighters and dinosaurs clash atop this massive we'll space. Check that now. Is it Elden Ring heavy? Players will yeah. even encounter dangerous mutations of dinosaurs, known as neosaurs. The most deadly among them. There's, the there's already been lots of jokes about people who are like. You'll need to work together with your team to stand a chance at taking like them down. Like all the people who just aren't familiar with the oh, FromSoft no. games. Is that a swarm of neo T Rexes? That they made outside of the Souls franchise. Because they made a few. I mean, you remember Ninja Wait, Blade? Of course you don't. No one remembers Ninja Blade. While it may look similar <laughs> to Deadeye, this exosuit is a variant called Deadeye Alpha Burst Fighter. Unlike the default Deadeye, this variant comes equipped with a weapon that can burst fire or be used as a shotgun, allowing exofighters to change their style of play. Exosuit variants, including Deadeye Alpha, will be added in a title update following the full. So I guess it's kind of like. Um... Earth Defense Force, video, but with dinosaurs instead of bugs. Gauntlet, a mode that lets you take on and it takes itself a bit more seriously. That change weekly. In this mode, players can enjoy a change of pace from dino survival by competing against exo fighters from all over the world for the fastest completion time. I think the fact it's your you're fighting dinosaurs is the stupidest thing. <laughs> I don't know what it is. Everything else about it sort of seems fine. And then it's you fight dinosaurs. It's like, why dinosaurs? Why couldn't it have been like some made up like alien or just some new monster form? It's like, nah, dinosaurs. It's lots of dinosaurs. It's like a stegosaurus. It's like, okay, okay. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, Kingsfield is from Soft as well. Yeah, like I said, they make. Although Kingsfield is. Like, early Dark Souls. Like, the, the like, Demon Souls. Was very clearly, like, the, like, the spiritual successor of Kingsfield. Because I think. There's a sword in a lot of the Souls games that comes from Kingsfield with the Moonlight Blades. I remember that. It's going to be Earth Defense Force. Well, not insects, but they could be fighting, like, I don't know, not dinosaurs. This is the last title we'll be showing off today. Oh, well, there you go. Don't have to cross your fingers too hard, then, that they're going to show anything else. But, yeah, Dragon's Dogma's cool. I only played a little bit Dragon's Dogma. In fact, I might even have it installed on my Xbox at the moment. I may have uninstalled it again. Thinking, this is the time that I play Dragon's Dogma. And, uh, it never happened. <laughs> I, I think I played the like, first two hours. Protected me from the dragon's flames. You need only believe in your own destiny, Arisa. Of course. That begs the question. If he's a mere mama, then where might our true Arisa? Empress Nadinia's life is in your hands, Sir Arisa. Praise be, for only the Sovereign's guidance can lead us true. Long live the Sovereign of Vermont! Mega Man Legends, Legends, Legends 2, Tron, Bo, and Game Collection. Well, look, they're running out of Mega Man games to make collections of. They've already done the old Mega Man games and the new ones, and they've just done Battle Network, so 
you know, Legends is next up on the agenda, I think. Is Dogma the one that leads into Nier? No. Uh, you are thinking of Drakengard. Uh, and it's the, f I want to say, fifth ending of Drakengard 2. It leads into Nier. いかがでしたでしょうか。ドラゴンズドグマシリーズは2012年に第1作を yeah, so the, the pawn mechanic in Dragon's Dogma was a big thing. Because you could create a pawn, and then other pe you, you, you could have your own pawns, but you could also... You had your main pawn, and then you had to yeah, borrow two support pawns. And if someone used your pawn, when they when you when they came back, you got a load of experience and items and stuff. It was kind of, kind of a cool system. It was kind of a cool system, and it rewarded you to make like a good pawn. But yeah, it's basically you create a main character, their, bu their, their permanent buddy, and then the two of you just team up with randos for the whole game. It's a cool little system. Saying porn, I thought you were saying porn. I mean, they're very similar sounding words, but a porn, I like the chess piece. The much less exciting one. Or more exciting one, you know, depending on what you're into. Yeah. Some people are really into chess. So, this is the first time I've seen the Dragon's Dogma 2. I've seen the first time I've seen the Dragon's Dogma 2. I've seen the first time i プレイヤーが思いついたアクションを全て yeah, so that, that was, again, like another bit that was... You fight a dragon or something quite early on in Dragon's Dogma. Um, I made an elf girl in the first game of Dragon's Dogma, she was popular. Yeah, I can imagine. I can imagine. See, I, this, I, I'd just be tempted to make like some little freak and no one would want it. I can't remember who I made. I think I made an elf guy, Archer or something. But yeah, it's like the giant monster battles are the cool parts of Dragon's Dogma. ほかにも本作ならではの新しい体験の数々も待っていますので、ぜひ続報にご期待ください。本日はありがとうございました。You're Dragon's Dogma 2 will be available on PlayStation 5, Xbox Series X, Xbox Series S, and Steam. Okay, I guess it doesn't have a release And date. now, a quick look at the Capcom 40th Anniversary Sale. Kicking things off, we have well-known titles, such as Dragon's Dogma and the Ace Attorney well, There you series. go! The perfect time to get into Ace Attorney. It's on this sale. opportunity to pick up a few of Capcom's most influential hits at some great prices. To celebrate, we're also offering a limited time bundle of some of Capcom's major titles on Steam. That wraps up today's Capcom Showcase. Thank you for watching. We're always Aww. working on new games and updates, and we hope you're as excited as we are for Capcom's 40th anniversary. Thanks for watching. See you next time. No Resident Evil 4 DLC. Well, 
Ace Attorney Part Bundle Trilogy Part Two is uh, worth watching for. Let's go back to Final Fantasy 16, I guess. I suppose for a little bit. But it will really will be for a little bit because I, uh, I don't want to play for too much longer. But I do want to see. Uh, I just like I said, I do want to see some of the, like the combat from the main game. Yeah, I, I, well, Capcom ones are weirdly short. They did say ahead of time it was only going to be 36 minutes, though, so I wasn't expecting it to be any longer than that. Um, but I guess they, you know, they showed off exactly as what as much as I much appreciate them just going look, going like look, we've only got 36 minutes to show off, so we're just gonna it's gonna be 36 minutes and that's it. Rather than uh, like. I haven't been watching every showcase. My friend has been and has been texting me as 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 he watches all of them. And the PC showcase was just complaining about like how long each of the trailers were because he was like, "This is this is pointless. This these are such terrible trailers." That I've had there's like th three minutes where I got no idea what this game is, and then they finally show what the game is, and it's like these are the worst trailers ever. And it's like I'm much. I much, I much more appreciate that. So, do those directs better than E3? Yeah, I mean, I, I get, I get the people who like used to attend E3 are disappointed, but I, it's, it is nice just being able to like pick and choose what you want to watch, and then you can, you know, if anything big comes out that's an event that that, that you don't watch, it'll get in front of your eyes eventually if it was meant to. PC and the Ubisoft was so bad, were they? I, I, yeah, I didn't watch the Ubisoft one. I did watch the gameplay trailer for that new Star Wars game, and it looks exactly like the kind of Star Wars game I imagine Ubisoft would make. I mean, it's not bad necessarily a bad thing, but it's an open world Ubisoft game. Yeah, it's an open. It's you know, little open world hubs. It basically it really does look a lot like Star Wars Jedi, but you play as a smuggler. Um, but that's just, I guess, the Star Wars aesthetic. You can't really, you can't really go too far away from what Star Wars looks like. So I'll probably pick it up. You know, I don't have a huge amount of interest in Ubisoft open world games, but I do like Star Wars. So I'm, I'm easily pleased. So yeah, we'll play. Like this bit doesn't carry over, so I'm not that as fussed about finishing this section. As long as we um, ourselves on this side of the bars. But I do want to see what the combat's like now that, like, what the actual combat in the game's going to be. So we'll play for like half an hour, just until we've got kind of a feel for it, and then we'll probably call it a night. Because I got no context about why I'm here or what I'm doing Sid, with this. This gate. Need some help. I'm just here with Sid and my dog. What do you think? I'm doing most of the lifting. Oh, the, the R2 is getting harder and harder to pull down. Careful with that sluice. That we don't get sluiced. Yeah, they've gone. They've gone back to sort of like proper fantasy rather than the fantasy tech like fifty, which I don't mind. I mean, seven was fantasy tech, and eight was. I, I guess they had the flying gardens and the gun blades, so it was a bit more. Yeah, see look at my dog. Alright, let's try one of the other ones. Oh, oh hang on, I missed the time. I missed the dodge timer there. That didn't come up before. Oh, so it's really dark. Let's try Garuda. Oh, I've got a limit break. Uh, no. <laughs> I'm not going to use it against one dude. 
Where to next? Okay, I mean, yeah, it's sort of sim still similar to what it was before. Hey, Speedstar. This is a demo. This is this 16's not out yet, yeah. This door only leads to more royalists. End of June. We better find but another one. Th this demo came out today. Uh, what? Where do they want me to go now? That oh, okay. They, we'll go through the window. Right away, it's so dark. Bloody show off. But yeah, they've got a lot more, uh, a lot more Game oh, of Thrones with this one the than, than fifteen. Right where the royal um, I mean, 15 had a car, so it was, and vending machines and noodles. This one has political interests. Okay, so yeah, Garuda, let me limit break. Okay. I pressed R1. Tell me I didn't. Hang on, did I accidentally equip like the easy mode shit? I did. Fuck. Hang on, let's turn that shit off. I was saying I, I, I didn't do that before. Yeah, this is the easy mode shit. I don't want this on. Oh, I've kept turn on while I'm in combat. Okay. That's basically, if you're bad at dodging, you can turn on a thing that lets you, that, that does that, that comes up with that red circle. Right, ah, uh, combat now. Get, get rid of this shit, I don't want it. Uh, can I just unequip? There we go. This doesn't do anything, does it? No. Badger might, badger metal, that's fine. And timely, 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 timely. Okay. That's fine. The rest of this stuff's okay. Okay, you can't use the dodge as a way to move forward quickly, because he. Get over here. Go over there. Get over here. Go over there. Get over here. Die. Get over here. I'm the good guy. Ooh, the five spools of still silk. I could make an incredibly powerful. Uh, Afghan or something. Oh, I'm not staying. I didn't do as much damage to him as I might have liked. I've almost broken his will. Oh yeah, I'm doing my icon abilities. Uh, let's wicked wheel him, and then do that one. And then I can set him on fire. And then I can do that, and then I can punch him. Fight me. 
Like, just, I'm just very flashy. Like, I got a lot of stuff popping off. Never were one for half measures, were you, Benedict? These poor sods didn't know what hit them. Favor of Fire, Scarlet Cyclone. Increases Scarlet Cyclone damage by 8%. Ooh. That's exactly how much extra damage I thought that attack needed. I saw those numbers and I thought, ooh, almost. All this bloody running. After them. How I had the the grab attack equipped. Attacking the opponent from the front while it is guarding will deal no damage. Certain basic abilities such as Burning Blade and Charged Magic, as well as iconic abilities such as the Phoenix Rising Flame, can instantly break an opponent's guard. Seems they were expecting. Oh, I can charge up my attacks now. Okay. How much can I charge? I guess it's not Oh, he's got a dog too! Oh, not anymore. And now I'm on fire. But in a good way. That's, it's pretty nice. Uh, that oh yeah, that extra eight percent damage. I wonder. They they did say that like oh it, it, you'll you'll have more abilities in the demo than you would at this point in the story. I do wonder whether you can trigger your limit break quite as often as I am. Feels like a lot. I feel like if you can trigger it that often, it kind of takes the shine off of it, you know? Feels less it feels a bit less special. Great because he's like big or just like a nice guy. What the hell happened here? Little Let late for prayer, isn't it? Let her cook. Do I seem so desperate as to grovel at the feet of a false god? <laughs> I was waiting for you. Not for too long, I hope. All this for a midnight chat. Well, let's chat then. Where are the men and women you took from Lost Wing? You mean, where's the dominant? Well, we shall be requiring his services indefinitely. Come back to me, Sidolphus. I need you. 
Think of all the things we can create together. The world that we can build. You need me. <laughs> Your king needs me. I'm all for building a new world. Just not his. That bastard's dreams are as twisted as his promises are false. And I want no part of them. I want to make airships. And this is how you speak of him. Flying no machines. Shred of loyalty. What? Dirigibles. To a leader who'd use me. Like he uses you. You know nothing of me, Sidolphus. You're right. I don't know who you are anymore. What you want. I only know what you used to say. That you were tired of running. That you just wanted to be free. Free of it all. You weren't lying to me then, so what changed? What made you think you had to sacrifice who you were to get what you wanted? Sacrifice? I use my talents to my advantage, and you would tell me there is shame in that? If there's no shame, then why do you feel so sorry for yourself? A rousing speech, Lord Commander. I was a fool to believe you might have changed. The only person I feel sorry for is you! I can't do this anymore. If you would stand between our leash and his dream, then you leave me no choice. Goodbye, Sidolphus. No. Wait. How is she Garuda? I've got Garuda as one of my... I, okay, I guess that's what I mean by I shouldn't have... <laughs> I don't have this power yet. Oh, is he Ramu? Clive's just playing with the dog at the side, just going, this is a good boy. This is nothing to do with us. He's fine. Why? Finish them. <coughs> okay, so I don't think she's. Well, Sid. At least it's not me against one. I guess multiple people can have blessings from icons. Yeah. I have Garuda's bless. Oh, I played. I played Final Fantasy XIV. I know what floor that was. Thing on the things are warming. And you know any vi any video game that has AOE attacks. Wait, did I come with my grenade break? Yeah. 
getting jostled. She doesn't look happy, Torgal. Come on. I killed one of them, I think. My limit for class. I realize now those ones have got. Oosh. I, I realize Titan's abilities have like a. a thing on it. You have to press and hold and then wait and then. yeah. Cool. I love that. <laughs> Ooh. I got, my, I got a clouded eye. Only two of them. One from each or two from one? I don't know. So, Sid, you dead. Or Sidithus, or whatever your full name is. Sidabon. Sid, are you all right? Yen, Sid. Do I look all right? <laughs> Benedicta will be on her way to collect the dominant, if she hasn't already. You can't afford to let them leave. Remember, she has wings, you don't. What about you? Before or after I catch my breath. Sorry. Come on, Toggle. Yeah, he's fine. Just, just quaff a few high potions. Maybe right is ready. All right, I think we'll call it there. I, I th there is quite a bit more of this demo. I think there's like two and a half hours. They, they, they said they, it takes about four and a half hours to do the whole thing, and we spent about two and a bit hours in the prologue, and then yeah, it's like two hours here, and you end in like the you know dramatic final boss, I'm sure, but. Given that if I decide to buy this game, I'd have to replay this section anyway. I don't want to play too much. For two reasons. A, because I just don't want to have to replay it. But also, I, I don't know... I don't really know why I'm here. I don't know what I'm doing, because it's they've skipped over several hours of plot. Just to give you a, a part of the game to play. And it's like, I kind of don't want to play if I don't know why I'm bothering. So... Um... Yeah, we'll stop there. It, the, but yeah, the gameplay's... Uh, I, the combat's fun enough, you know. I, 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 got, I got a feel for it. It doesn't feel as... Like... I, I played quite a lot of 15, and there were still parts of the combat that I didn't really feel like I knew what I was doing when I was doing it. This, I feel like I know what I'm doing and exactly when I need to do it. And, um, I mean, I don't know what my companions are doing. They're just kind of there. But, you know, you dodge when stuff hits, you get behind it, you get like a cool little animation to show when you've done it right. You, you explode in fire, you turn into monsters. I think I can dig it. I, 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 I still not 100%, I don't, you're right there, he's fine. I'm still not, I don't know, I am kind of more interested in the story now that I've played through the prologue bit. Um, 
But I think I was kind of interested in, like, I kind of liked the relationship between Clive and Joshua. And then Joshua died. So, uh... I, I guess it's... I, I, I quite like the story of young Clive. Like, I don't know necessarily why I like the story of old Clive. But no, no, I don't know. I, I, maybe I'll, maybe I'll think I'll, I'll stew on it for a couple of weeks and see how I feel when Final Fantasy 16 comes out. This Dragon Quest is quick. Eleven level is big. I, I don't know. I, I'll, uh, yeah, I'll, I'll take your word for it. It's just me whether I've seen this plotline already with a certain Tales game. Well, I don't know what the plotline is, because the, I mean, the opening bit was about the, the, the what from what I've generally got from it is that there are. Lots of different factions who were all blessed by an icon and like have an icon, what they call a dominant. And the dominant can turn into the that icon. So the dominant of our family was my brother who could turn into the phoenix. I'm, I, I'm pretty sure Clive turns into Ifrit. I'm pretty sure Clive, Clive is Ifrit's dominant. Because that's how the game was marketed. Uh, and we met the guy who could turn into Titan. I think the other lady. I don't know if she's Garuda's dominant or if she's just blessed by Garuda. It's not clear. Um, we saw Shiva's dominant as well. She could turn into Shiva. So there's like. And then there's like big monster battles with them. Um, so I assume at some point, yeah, you fight against Titan, you fight against Garuda, and Bahamut, and Ramu, and Fat Chocobo. All of them, you know, all, all the fun ones. Look, uh, Alexander. Doom Train. Oh, I want to fight a train. I want to I wanna fight the man who turns into a train. So yeah, I don't know. I, I don't really know. I mean, it's more Avatar than anything else, as I said earlier, but... Yeah. Like I said, I'll stew on it for a couple of weeks, and then maybe decide, like, right before it comes out what they play it. If I buy it, I... I definitely won't stream the whole game, because it's a Final Fantasy game, and they're long. But maybe I'll stream, like, the first few hours when it comes out, just as a sort of, like, Hey, it's a new game! Maybe, maybe you'll, like, maybe, you know, if you're on the fence, maybe watch me play it for a bit. Ah, uh, but I guess it depends when it comes out and what day. So, anyway, we'll call it there. Thanks for watching. If you did, I will be back tomorrow. We will definitely play Zelda tomorrow. I know I said we played Zelda today and we didn't play Zelda, but I didn't know this was coming out and I wanted to play this. So, but we'll play Zelda tomorrow. Uh, uh. Oh, actually, no. I need to double check. I might not be. Able... Oh, my dog's gone. I, I guess he got bored. Right, bye, dog. He's run off. Like, he's really properly run off, hasn't he? Okay, well, that's fine. The dogs dogs are like that. Uh, I might not, post, might not stream tomorrow. If I do stream, it will be Zelda. So, uh, if, if, if I see you then, I will see you then. Otherwise, I will see you next time I stream. Uh, yeah. Thanks for watching. Have a dandy evening. Stay dandy. Um, play Phoenix right.